All right. Uh, so <laughs> I looked it up, and apparently we might actually be able to finish this within, like, a very short period of time. Uh, I thought we had uh, three chapters left, but no, we've only got two, five, and six. Uh, so this might be a quick and... Oh, well. Anyway. It's uh, the creature. Yeah, it's the creepy version of the main character. At least we think it is. Yeah. And there's the... Can you go back? There's the Lady in Stone. And... Ah, look, wait! That sword has the same sun symbol on it as the treasure chest. Oh. Yeah, look at that. <gasps> what? He's stabbing her through? How dare he? All right, so so there's the mama unicorn turtle with the baby turtle. Mm -hmm. Dropping him off. The extremely evolutionarily disadvantaged creatures. <laughs> All right, now he's at the... a couple of them. The creepy ruined forest. Was that inspect? Yeah, it was that inspect. You just up? Okay. Okay, so does that mean he didn't inspect it? Oh, oh, interesting. Oh, is it a map? If you notice, yeah, there's a Ah. Yeah. There's a kind of All right, so if he didn't draw on his hand. Oh, there was this the tree with the creed. Oh, is he just going to get lost forever? <laughs> this is the Lost Woods. Oh, he made it somewhere. Wait, wait. Did No, he I think he made it back to the beginning again. Yep. See? So, thank goodness he got out at one point, but he is going to have to have that map. So he kind of scrawled it with dirt upon his palm. Unless I'm supposed to... Oh, no. So with the page turning, I have to do this. Wait, wait. Do you turn left and right? Yeah. Ah, uh, okay. So now he has it on his hand. All okay. right. Okay. So that means the first time we take a left, right? Yeah. And then we take another left. And then we take a right and a left and a right. Yeah. Okay, here. I'm going to write that down. I'm going to let's go back and snag um Why why do we need to to do that? I want to snag inspect. I think we're going to need it. So Oh, so you're right. Okay. So it's left left right right left and then right. Can you repeat that back cuz you okay. you were saying stuff when I was saying stuff. Left left right left right. Yeah. yeah. That's yep. it. That's it. Cuz if I can take it so left, left, right, left, right. Yep, there we go. Yeah, okay. And that way you can keep the word inspect. Yep. Now oh. you're right there. And it's the uh, the shade The critter. shade creature. Ah. Uh, except he's tripped. And is going to wield a stick against him. Uh-oh. Pull out. Okay, to pull out of his grasp. You're going a little too swiftly, though. Yeah, sorry. Okay, so yeah, he can pull out of his grasp. He's got like a weird, like, flat face thing going on. I thought it was like just kind of squarish, but no, he's even got like a hardish edge right there. Mm hmm. But again, don't many of the creatures in this world, the humanoid ones, have yeah, you're square right. faces as well? Okay, so he pushes off but hits a tree. And the creature has immensely sharp claws. You're still going too fast for me. Oh. Bad news. Oh, you have to start again? Left. Left. Right. Left. Right. Yeah, so the point of pull out... Is that... 
pull out just resets us. So if I take this and we strength. Wait. Interesting. He still throws you against the tree? Yeah. Well, this is why we need inspect. Oh, uh, nope, it doesn't allow you to do inspect. Oh. Alternatively. So he runs. But now you have pull out. Yeah. So what happens if you pull out something? Oh, <laughs> no. What? Huh. Unless... Unless there's another path to the sword. That could be it. Maybe if we take the reverse? Why don't you try the opposite way? Sure. Because, yeah, there's nothing I can do here. I'll inspect it again, just because. Yeah, it's the exact same thing. Oh, wait, look at that. Left, left, right, left, right. Yeah. Yeah, that's... That's it. We've got a couple of different... Because we did this, assuming this was this terminus, but maybe what if we started from up here? We got a couple of different options. Okay. Okay, so what's the opposite then? Right, right, left, right, left. Nope. Nope. That's the way back to the start. Okay. I'm just going to keep trying a couple options. Right. Left, right, left, left. Yep. All right, one more shot, and then I'm out of ideas. Left, right, left. Wait, wait, look at that. The scratches, they go to each tree. Yeah, See? There we go, follow the scratches. Yeah, follow See, the I was scratches right. the scratches rather than the, than the path. That's interesting. Okay, so sees. Oh, that's interesting. Where the sword pierced her chest, there's kind of this spiraling darkness. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. You don't want to pull out the sword yet. Can't. We have to inspect before we can pull out the sword. Yeah. All right. So he's pulled the sword out, and there's a light. Oh. Wait, the flowers are growing yep. back? Ah, oh, has, has that displeased the creature? It has. The creature is mad. Then again, the creature looks perpetually mad. Oh, well, now he has the sword with him. But we already know the path. Oh, everything's grown over, though. Yeah, well... Oh, oh, that just means we can't go back. The original path, though. There we go. Oh, now it's right. raining. Ranger. It's raining, but now we have the sword on hand. Ah. Oh. Yeah, he's evaded the creature at every step. Oh, no! Slash. Oh. Sort of an inky-like blood. It falls backwards, but then grabs him. Reaches out. Ah. Yeah, maybe because he's made of like shadow stuff. Lifting him high and then just throwing him into the the ravine. Yep. Ooh, it's bloom to wither. Chapter six: Work experience. We are hiring. Don't waste time. Join our family. Feed your career. We are what you're looking for. Honestly, reminds me of the slogans thrown at me when I got my job at a grocery store. Ugh. Yeah, it doesn't feel good. Rip. Rip. 
Just like a little splish. Yep. Oh, wait, I didn't get to see the second page. Wander, you go way too fast. I am quick. All right, so he sees the sword, and... He also sees a chungus. Oh, whoa. Oh, it, it's one of those things that has a, a mouth for a stomach and is the epitome of greed. Does he have a bunch of... Wait, so this king consumer guy, he knits these little dolls with the button faces to collect essentially the like fruity pebbles for him? I think they're gems. Right, right, but I'm saying fruity pebbles. Yeah. Because that's what they, I mean, they hopefully they taste good. <laughs> uh -huh. Oh no! They're offering him the sword. Or no, he's handed the sword off to a guy to take to the elevator. No, I think the elevator's behind him. This guy's taking it down somewhere. Um. Mm -hmm. But the elevator is locked. Mm-hmm. Yep, it is locked. Uh-oh. Like, I saw him? And what's that time? <coughs> oh, it's a clock. Yeah. I think this is actually allegorical to working. You know, see, he sees his freedom, but mm -hmm. now he's on the clock. Ah, yep. Oh, listen. Actually, time is ticking. It looks like you have to choose... J Gemstones, right? He's like, Arr! oh, so if you don't work, do the work, you get thrown in this dungeon. Wait, what about that book? Time's still passing. I'm on the clock. Uh huh. So, is there nothing more you can do here? Ding, ding, ding. Okay. Look at they, all the, look all the creatures the are seams. yeah they are I I don't think you need to continually go to that one I think you just need to hit them each once right maybe I think we have to do this multiple times. Mm hmm Well, next time, try to get each of the color. Yeah. No. Still not good enough? Yeah, I oh. need to break them. No, you... It looks like you need a word to in order to look at the book. Like, I think we're supposed... Aha, oh. see? Oh, you finally cracked a hole. Ah, and the sword is kept in the back room. But we can't do anything about it yet. Because we see it, but we can't interact with anything. Mm-hmm. But where are you supposed to go? I think he just waits there like a ninny. Oh, you got the word open for the book. Two opens. I'm going to leave this one. Okay. Because I suppose you would need an open for the door, right? Mm-hmm. Oh, that's interesting. Comic books. And that looks like the first Superman. Yeah, so we should probably go back and open up all those doors. Mm-hmm. Okay. So you're on the clock again. Okay. Are you going to open the book? Oh, look at that. That so green, black and blue pushes forward time on that side? Maybe that's just G. And then it's the kind of gold 
red and purple. I don't know if it's like a day cycle or a night cycle, but don't you notice that? How one page is gold and the other one looks like it's full of stars and is dark. Mm -hmm. I think it's day and night. So this is a puzzle involving the passage of time then. Yeah. Well. So I think you're going to have to choose your rocks wisely. See, he set it to the the top. So what do you want it to be? Okay. It looks like you can do green, green. Ah, nope. we're supposed to do green, green, and blue. But that's okay. I'm not done exploring yet. Are you going to go down the hole? I think so. I think it's just all on the clock. All right, what do you have to open? We might as well just do every door. Mm -hmm. Just to see as we go by. Oh, Naruto! <laughs> oh, but he falls asleep in there? Oh, wait, look! Green, black, blue. And then look. Oh. No, you should have done. Um, look at the. You are doing more pages. That one could have been like the. Oh, you're still on the top. Oh, I see. You're on the day side. Okay, night side is the purple and the red. Yep. We'll miss that on whatever. And then the gold and the purple. Yep. Yeah, no go. more. Yeah, so we'll miss out on one of the graphic novels, but oh well. Don't you mean two? Uh, no. Only one. I thought we had only seen Superman and Naruto. There were three doors. Oh. There might have been more. They liked your work. Well, we're not under on the clock anymore. Yo, you missed the... Or we were. The present. Okay. I mean, it's not a big deal. Damn it. Hey, you needed an open it's for okay. the present. Mm-hmm. At least, like, at this point, I know what I'm doing, so it's easy peasy. Mm-hmm. Kind of annoying. Because, yeah, I, I noticed we weren't under time constraints anymore, so I'm like, oh, hey, we're free. The answer is no. Okay. Now it's the red and the gold or the purple. Yeah. <gasps> no, you got a green. Oh, okay. So what? As long as the time doesn't run out, you yep. can undo your selections. Yeah, it just was not braining there. That's easy. Okay. Oh, it's a picture of him. Employee of the month. Oh. So you haven't done the work. Keep going to the doors? Yeah. Do 
Because, yeah, we need this sword. Oh! You're right. There are there are the doors. Yeah. Okay. So we do one, two, three, four. We might as well check the second one. Let's just check all of them. Mm-hmm. Well, remember, he always falls asleep. Yeah, but... Oh, hey, it's the how to how to make comics book that we read in yep. college. Uh, uh. <laughs> yeah, it's a bit of a shame we have to go through this entire rigmarole just to see what's behind every single door. Mm -hmm. Oh well. <sighs> It does amuse me that he's like, oh, I'm just going to go in here and fall asleep. It's like, no, you're on the, on the clock, my dude. But it's okay. Well, he was kind of banished there. Yeah, sure. Okay, so that's door number two. Now, was door number three the one with Superman? Yeah. Or Naruto? I think it was, that was the one with Superman. Naruto was the first door. Mm hmm. Might so this well one see what's you want to one. open? Might as well. We're here. Because eventually you're going to have to open the final door. Oh, is that is that supposed to be Lawrence of Arabia or something? Oh, uh, mm, I don't know. Who is that? I don't know that one. It looked like he almost had like a filter on his face. Mm -hmm. Maybe Fahrenheit 451? Uh. I don't know. Ugh. <sighs> Unless, of course, we need all four opens for this last section. I thought you could only hold three at a time. Oh, you're right, you're right. So, just nothing there. Oh, maybe that's even the point. You have to go through the, um, the opening the uh, employee of the month because mm -hmm. there's four opens that go by. Ah. Uh, mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, because they're, they're traps. And so you have to clear your inventory out to be able to, uh, to yeah. be able to even progress at this point. Oh, that's okay. That's really clever. All right. Well, now you can open this. Burp. But just, just let it, let it. Open. I know. I just wanted to see what would happen. All right. You have the sword. Oh, and he's striking at the elevator. Oh, wait, can you go back for a moment? I didn't get to see that. Oh, okay, so the big guy was just grinning and he was going to set the clock back. Mm-hmm. But no. All the little guys are going to rebel. Ah, and he's taking the opportunity to escape, but they're praising him all the same. Mm-hmm. Oof. Chapter 7, The Castle of Self. Oh, so it was called the Ragdoll Revolution. Mm -hmm. From where it came, that locked in wait, had he ever had a dream to share, Kai became a mere shadow of himself, for there were only his limits and commands, with a mountain made of papers, the kind which we cannot climb. Okay, so he's on some snowy mountain peak. And there's the castle. Uh-oh. He got swiped at by the creature. Oh, who's doing some dastardly oh, business here? Some kind of shadow magic. Yeah, he's he's trapped and he's being flung about too. Wait. Oh. What? The sword was left behind, but He's using it as a... Hey! Yeah, we can actually give him a thought. Blam. Oh, 
Oh, interesting. So in this, he what actually does he... might have actually killed the creature. Might have actually killed the creature. And there's the shattered mirror, but the mirror is himself, right? Probably. And he has no thoughts. Does does this just re begin the cycle anew? Where he becomes the next creature that's lost? Probably. Possibly. Yep. Oh. Look out. Uh. I think mm. you have to tell the creature to look out. Oh. Oh, he becomes a new shadow creature if you just accept and give him the. Yeah, I guess the so. Chest? What if you don't accept? We can't progress. I think we just need to look out to get accept, accept from it. Mm hmm. Look out, actually. I know. I just wanted to uh -huh. see if accept would work. Look out! Oh, wait. He still gets clawed down regardless? That's a waste. <laughs> I, I don't think except would have... I think there's got to be more to this. Uh-huh. Ah. Except... No. No. Open? Oh, so he spares his life. Aw. Wait, wait, what about the chain? Did, or he's he noticing the, the chain. empty chain. Oh, so they're both going to drag the chest. Oh, he needs help from him too. Are there two opens? They both need the same thought here. Or can one open and one accept? No. No, no, he has to accept. Oh, maybe you have to... Oh. We accept there, but now there's no open. Yeah, so we need the lookout. Do you know what the sad thing is? I think we might have to go into the chamber after killing the creature with something else. Maybe that's it, actually. We, we accepted him too early. Oh, is there another accept? Mm-hmm. Two accepts. Two opens. Oh, it's a mirror. You're replicating them. Oh, so you need two opens. You have to put one accept back. Yeah. There's her answer. Oh, wait. I have them now. Okay, there we go. Okay, so now you have the one accept and you have two opens. Yep, so it was the mirror. Oh, look at that. Yep. Uh, they're both... Po hey, can you go back? I didn't get to see that. And the mirror is whole. Mm-hmm. All right. 
And now we see that the fate of Kai's... He's going to be a dad with awful amounts of paper. We don't actually know if he's going to okay, be a dad. Okay, okay, fine. He isn't a dad. He's going to be a much older man with Just an insurmountable of amount of work. Paperwork. Oh, is that... Wait, is that a tear running yeah. down his cheek? Yeah. Sad that his future is being a corporate wage slave. But with statistics, but what's coming out of the chest? Think for yourself. I'm gonna be honest. Oh, wait. Okay, look, there we go. Look, yes, I, it'd be terrible if there wasn't some kind of epilogue. So he was sleeping at his desk. Mm -hmm. Is that what it was? He's yeah. startled awake. I still don't like it when they pull the real world, like it was all just kind of a dream. Like, it works here. Especially because I didn't have enough time to get invested. Uh, yeah. Wait, is this just a prequel to Stardew Valley? It is. <laughs> well, yeah, so it's really just the drudgery of everyone being told to do the same thing. It's up, so he's just quitting. Yeah, he's going to quit his job and follow his dreams of being a it, kayak well, no, paddle no, no, no. salesman. Uh, no, no, no. I think maybe he's going to be a comic book illustrator or something because you noticed how all of those books oh hey it's the it, two guards oh yeah they are but if you notice when he was going through those doors that those it was full of manga and comic books and so I think that's what this is Ah, so he's enjoying the sea. I don't know if that's supposed to be reminiscent of the turtles with the horns and the sails or something. Well, the shells. Mm -hmm. The triangular shells. Yeah, what does the, what does the future hold for him? I think that's maybe the point that he wants to be able to decide his own future. Yeah. So then who was the woman with the sword in her chest and the... Yeah, and I, I think that's what I was going to go with. The the point of everything being allegorical hurts the narrative a little bit in my end. Like, yeah, it's like, oh, yeah, this is just kind of like his life. But... Well, what were the chapters again? The first one was just... Oh, Achievement Unlocked, Fan of Kai. Oh, is it just if you start again? Yeah. Wasn't there a chapter select over on the far right? Maybe. I want to double check. There's apparently a hidden achievement somewhere. Well... So, wake up Kai, not alone, lawful cheater, good deeds pay well, bloom wither, ragdoll revolution, think for yourself. Oh, here we right, go, awakening. Awa well, can you go back? So, the awakening was just him making his way down the road, correct? And mm -hmm. there was... Was the... Rock in the clock. That was when he had to skip across the river, right? Or no, 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 the dragon, the dragon one. Yeah. Remember? Yep. And that's the game of cards. Yeah, to even be able to get in. That's outwitting the people with the masks in the city. That's the maze. That's the work. Yep. The castle of self. So, what do you think? Oops. Ah. Wrong button. What do I think what? So, do you think there's supposed to be stages of his life up until his inevitable time as an adult working? Maybe. Or I, I to be entirely honest, like I don't I don't feel like delving too deep into the the psychology of all of this. Uh I am really not exaggerating when I say I really don't do not like it when games do the like, but it was all just allegorical for reality. 
or it was all a dream or, yeah because it's yeah. like i don't necessarily hate it but it's just like for me it always ends up taking away from the world itself because then it's just like oh you never should have actually been invested in any of these locations because they were just an allegory for something uh as opposed to it's like, a very it's a very wizard of oz yeah, and it's part of the reason why I didn't care too much for Wizard of Oz to some degree uh, until I read the books and they kind of imply that, no, the, it's like a much more real place and she really did just stumble in that in on it. Mm -hmm. um, but, you know, the idea of these these like fantastical worlds that are just very much all in our head because, uh, you know, coping mechanisms or dreaming or something like that. And it's like, no, but I, w I want to know more about this world. Who was the lady of the statue? Why was there this, you know, loose shadow creature? Because to some degree, the narrative would have been more interesting if straight up the shadow creatures are previous uh, chest bearers mm -hmm. that failed. Right. And so there's tons of them all over the place. And Kai just manages to befriend one. And the two of them manage to escape. Now... The chest itself, was it supposed to be symbolic Hope, of... Hope, dream, thinking yeah. for himself. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Nothing more. But it's just like, I don't know. You could have had the whole thing away. be kind of allegorical without ever leaving the world. You know, maybe it's kind of like the implication of like, well, yeah, this could have actually all been just like fake. I mean, realistically, it's a fictional game one way or another, but it's just like, I don't know. I, I thought that... It was really clever, some of the puzzles. Yeah, I where, agree. Where I, I liked it when, you know, you angered the gambler enough so that you could see his I, cards through the mirror and the what we just did with the clock, where you know what crystals you can mine at what times of the day, and that will, that actually allows you to progress, and yeah seeing each and every door but i wish there had been more to it because i think the idea of this for like a branching narrative could be so cool but i realized that that would take so much more time mm -hmm. and the maze was interesting too the what were some other i obviously the, the mirror at the very end mm -hmm. using that in order to replicate the number of commands that you had yeah Uh, yeah. I I guess it's cool, but it's also one of those where it's like it's kind of a shame that we didn't get to use those mechanics more and more interchangeably. But where we would oh the other thing too is if you could accrue a library of things. Yeah. And try different words. Like I said, this whole thing would have been so much more interesting to some degree if it was like longer and had more branches because there's so many toys in this toy box that would have been really cool. Like, how cool would it be if we got, like, a, a really unique word and could go back to the very beginning of the story and just change everything? Mm hmm But alas. Do you start with any new words? No. When you begin the game again? No. No? No. I don't think so. Because it'd be interesting if you did. Nope. Nothing. There's one hidden achievement that we don't have, but... I, mm -hmm. I'm not terribly interested in like going way out of my way to find out what it is let's see yep nothing apparently there was a demo oh right yeah the demo that well we... yeah the demo for the demo thon yeah that we missed oh well anyway with all this said this is a neat experience i'd like to see more games kind of follow this because i've always wanted a really heavy branching narrative game where yeah you you can affect how things work by like picking a different action and then maybe even going back in time and then uh, doing a different action and that changes the results now that you know something or have something extra. Where where do you think in this game there would have been a different way that events could play out? Uh, I don't know. I I think to some degree this this specific narrative is so linear. But there is... there. I mean, there were definitely a couple of points where uh, they interacted with the shadow person. Mm -hmm. And those would have been spots. I I guess it just feels like because it was all just amounting to him accepting himself as 
like a person, an independent person and not just a wage slave, I, it's hard for me to have any immediate ideation of like what could have been because it's such a, that is such a hard end to, no, no matter what the narrative would still go to him being, we would still end up with him just being like, I'm actually like, I should value myself and live as opposed to just work this crappy job all the time. I, I, well, it's also, there was also the whole thing about that city where everyone became a masked. Yeah. And it's like, I. Individual that had to conform, whereas the girl with the music was yeah. non conforming. I, I guess. You know how in uh, Princess Mononoke, it mm -hmm. had some pretty strong environmentalist vibes. Mm -hmm. And, you know, somewhat anti industrial, somewhat like uh, properly preserving nature and respecting the land and so on and so forth. Um, I, I think uh, the easiest example with that would be like if Ashitaka woke up at the end and it turns out that, you know, he just quit his factory job because it was polluting the nearby river or something like that. Or mm. maybe polluting the nearby forest. Like, that's where I'm stuck here. It's like the moment any game does that, I just lose any sense of potential and I'm just like, well, that was it. I don't know. Anyway, I'm getting tired. I'm running out of things to say. Ah. I just feel bad. I do, sort of, but I. I really liked it. I I <laughs> wish that it's just my least favorite trope, and I can't help but be, just be like, aw. Mm -hmm. Anyway, if you want to do any closing thoughts, that's fine. But I'm out. All right. Well, I thought it was beautifully drawn, and I really did like all of the how the puzzles added on. I I I never anticipated that we would have something like the page flipping for the yeah. maze. Yeah. As being the directions. Yeah, I think you did a good job with those. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it, it was fun to find the mechanics as you went along. The ones in addition to the commands themselves. But, in any case. Thank you all so much for watching, and we'll see you next time.